Hello, um. Hello, Wong. Hello. Hello, Wong. Hello, teacher. Uh, again, again, again. Hello, Wong. Hello, teacher. Oh, I cannot hear you. Wong? Yes. Can you say hello? Hello. Oh. Again, again, again. Can you say hello? Hello. hello. All right, I can hear you. Okay, so how are you today, Wong? I'm fine. Again, again, can you speak louder? Teacher cannot hear you. I'm fine. Oh, wait a minute, Wong. I have to check the audio. Wait a minute because I cannot hear you. Wait for me. Okay. Okay. Okay, Huang, can you hear me now? Uh, can I can you say hello? Yes, yes. Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, so how are you today, Huang? I'm fine. Okay, is it raining there tonight? No. Okay, so here, can you hear that? Can you hear that? Yes. Yeah, it's been raining very hard right now. And also there is a lightning, okay? So if ever that our class will be caught, that means we have no electricity, okay? Okay. Yeah, because as you can hear, it's been raining very hard right now. Okay, anyway, you want? So for yeah. today, we're going to continue the activity that we were not able to finish yesterday, okay? Yes. So yesterday, we had listening activity and we started um, speaking activity. So it means we're going to continue the speaking activity, okay? Okay. Okay. All right, here, Wong. So this is the second part of the speaking activity. Now, let's talk about you and your home. Okay, this is very nice, Wong. Question number one, where do you live? You live in, ha in Hanoi, Vietnam. Okay, so do you know the name of your street? No. Um, okay, so you know only that you live in Hanoi, Vietnam, right? Yes. Okay. So um what what kind is your house? Is it what? okay, that's very loud. All right. Wait a minute long, I will just close my window, okay? You. Yes. Because the thunder might hit my laptop. Okay, I close already the window. Okay, okay so so long. Um what what is the kind of your house? Is it a house? Is it a flat? Is it an apartment? What kind of house do you live in? Is it, again, is it a house? Is it a flat? Or is it an apartment? Apartment. Apartment. Okay, so how many floors does your house have? Wow. Four? Five. Okay. Again, again. How many? Twelve. Five. No. Oh, four. Yeah. It's four. Yeah. I cannot 
can't see it. You put it on the camera. Twelve. Yeah. So you are living on the twelfth floor. Yeah. Okay, that's very high. So how do you go up in your um house? Do you have an elevator or do you have stairs? You have a lift? Yes. Okay. All right. So now, Huang, let's um answer number two question. What do you like doing at home? Oh, what do you like doing at home? When you're inside your house, Huang, what do you want to do there? Uh, play with my brother. You play with Trong. Okay. So what are the games that you like to play with Trong? Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Okay. So let me ask you, Huang, how many rooms does your house have? I don't know. A room, bedrooms. How many bedrooms do you have in your house? Two. Two. Okay. So the first bedroom is your mom and dad's bedroom, and the other one is you and Trung's bedroom? Yes. Okay. All right. So aside from playing with Trung, what else do you want to do when you're at home? I, I'm cooking with my mother. Okay. You like to help your mom in cooking. So what's your favorite food to cook? Cake. Cake. Oh, that's very nice. What kind of cake? Is that a chocolate cake? Yes. Okay, very good. So your mom knows how to bake, right? Yes. Bake means um that is how you make a cake or some cookies. Our next one, Huang, number three. We have breakfast. In, my where, dad's where, room. in your dad's room right yeah okay oh, why do you eat there why not in the why not in the kitchen or in the dining room uh, I have Do you have a dining room? Yes. Yeah. Okay, how about a kitchen? Yes. Yeah. All right. So now, um, Huang, I want you to tell me more about your home. Okay, let's talk about your home. So you said you live on the 12th floor, right? Yes. Yeah. And then, um, what can we see inside your living room? Uh... Um, oh. I three a road. I see a road. I see okay. a, I see a car. Mm hmm oh, What else do you have in your living room? Okay, do you have a television? Yeah. How about... Mm. A sofa? Yeah. All right. And then how about in your dining room? What can we see there? Uh, I see a table. A table. Oh, what else? Do you have a chair also? Yes. Yeah. Okay, because you know what? Some of my students, um, they don't have a chair in their dining room. They only have a, a small table and then they sit on the floor. 
uh, they they eat like that. They just sit on the floor and they eat their food there, their their meals there. Okay, well, how about in your bedroom, Huang? What can we see there? A bed. Of course, there's a bed. How many beds? Two. Two. That is one for you and one for Trung, right? Yes. Uh, what else? Do you have a television in your bedroom? Yes. Okay. Is it big or small? No. Uh, uh, how about a desk? Do you have a desk also? Yes. How many? One. One. Okay. That's that's where you're studying right now, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you have a play rule? Huang? Yes. Playroom, do you have a play rule? Yes. Okay. So that is a place where you play your toys. Okay. So next one, Huang, look at the picture here. Okay, as you can see, we have here four different pictures, okay? So all you have to do, Wong, is to make a story, okay? So this is the first part. Fred and Jack are watching television. Mom is saying, go outside and play football. A sunny day, okay. So how about picture two, Wong? What can you say about it? Also, in number one, it says that Fred and Jack are watching television and mom said, go outside to play football. It's a sunny day. How about number two? I can see a square. You can see one. A square. A square? A square. Huh? I don't see a square. I don't see a square. You don't see the screen? Yeah. Oh, why? I don't know. Okay, uh, I will share the screen one more time. Uh, can you see it now? Yes, yes. All right. Uh, so how about number two, Wong? Uh, what can you say about the picture? Um, Uh, the boy is say a water and she sing it rain. Oh, so the boy, the boy saw some water and they thought it's raining. Okay, that's correct. Well, how about number three? And the Mom is putting it on the water and the boy is um at that. Okay, so the mother looked up and she's laughing, right? So they are all laughing. Why are they laughing, Huang? How about number four? Why are they laughing? Uh, the is, um, the man is, um, yeah, um, a tree. Yes, because the father is watering the plants, right? Yes. Okay, so they thought it was rain, but 
It's not. It's just the father is just watering the plants upstairs. Okay, very good, Huang. So now let's move here. Okay, now Huang, look at the picture. Which one here is different and why? Okay, start with number one. Let the number one is the book. It's, it's the book. Why? Why a book? Because everyone eat, can eat, but book is not. Okay, everything you can eat, but the book you can't. Okay, good job. Oh, wait a minute. All right, how about number two? Lion because everyone is um because every lion it can swim. Yes, because all the uh, pictures here can swim or lives in the water while the lion cannot swim. Very good. How about number three? Take the number four. Because All right. Is left, but um, take the number four is not. All right. Because the three pictures are sleeping while the girl is awake. Very good. Okay, last one. Huh? Take the number two. Okay, why two? Because everyone is inside the house, but the moon is outside the house. Okay, very good. Let's see. Okay, that's correct, Huang. Very good. You got a perfect score of four points. Okay. Okay, so now let's continue. Wait for me. I will open the next one. Okay, so now well, let's continue with um, a reading activity. Let's begin. Oh, wait a minute. Where is it now? All right, now, well, so this is part number one. Look and read, choose the correct words and write them on the lines. There is one example. So example one, you see this green plant on the ground in some garden. So the answer is a grass. Okay, so you have to choose from the pictures. Okay, number one. Home. It is like a small cow. There are cow and people in it. It's by the A village. Okay, that's correct. Next one. They are white lot tree indeed in the forest. Very good. Let's see if you are correct. Okay, forest is correct. How about number three? Ball going deep. Yes. Live in it. Uh, a lake. A lake. Okay, number four. You see this moon, sand, and tree in a lake. 
Leaves, very good. Next one. Um, car, bus, a lorry, go on kid in grass, grass, a road. A road, next one. Do you have cloth water in this place? It's a island. It's a island. An island. Okay, very good one. That's a total of six points for you. Okay, next one, Huang. So all you have to do here in part number two is to look at the picture. Yes or no. Okay, example. The man is reading a comic and smiling. Answer is yes. The woman has a towel on her head. Answer is no. All right, number one, Huang. A boy who on the balcony wearing a flat suit. Yes. No. Number two. Oh, yeah. Inside the apartment, you see a plan between two lamps. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, next one. Um, there are a cup on the armchair in a living room. No. No, next one. There are black and white rabbit under the mantel. Yes. Yes. yes, number five. The boy. The boy. The boy who wearing hair curly fair hair. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, and last one. All people in this room is kissing you. Mm -hmm. No. No. Okay, so you only got one wrong answer. So that means you got five points in this activity. Okay, next one, Huang. So in this part, we're going to read a conversation between Jill and Daisy. Example, there's a new girl in our class today. So that is letter C was there. Okay, how about number one, Huang? She 10 like you? I no, she got nine. No, she's younger. Okay, number two, Wong. And what's her name? She didn't marry. Again, again, again. What's her name? She is is Mary. Her she's name is Mary. Yes. Number number two number two. Yes. Okay, it's letter A. It's Mary, I think. Number three. Who did she sit with?
The all children were there. Oh, she sat next to me. Number four, has she got any brother or sister? Yeah, I don't know. Okay, I don't know. Number five, did you play with her in the playground? Yes, I was there. Yes, we had a good one. Oh, number six. And has she got a bike? She, yes. She... Oh, and have letter A. Yes, we can write to school with her. Okay, so that you got two correct answers here, Huang. Oh, two correct answers only and four four wrong answers. Okay, wait a minute, Huang. So let's go to the next one, our last activity. Okay. So in this part, Wong, all you have to do is to read a story and choose your answer from the pictures. Okay, start now, Wong. Okay. Oh, Mr. Lime. Love his born at two every day. He was the elephant and gave the and give the blank oh, what is it a lion and tiger they food but if favorite animal way to conquer every morning he put some food in big yellow boat, took it to them kangaroo away, saw him and hop to the bow. Yeah. Okay, that's correct. They enjoy it. Okay, continue. Little lamb, but to make up for in the kangaroo bowl for them to eat. He was wait. But did come. I don't understand this. Then lamb does. He can find the kangaroo. He told the woman to what in the you. Oh, what's your answer number four? I don't understand this, Mr. Lime. Oh. Again, again, number four. Oh. Thought. Okay, correct. Next one. Um. I can't find. A kangaroo. He told the man what in the zoo. Hmm, I can find the kangaroos. He told me, he told the woman who worked in the zoo. Shop. 
Shop. Okay, continue. Go. Oh, I had a new baby yesterday. He said, Look, they are sleeping outside. They enjoyed the hot sun. Now, got three favorite or animal. The men love not to he long. She laughed. Okay, very good. So, um, all right, Huang. So that ends our activity for today. Now let's continue this one again tomorrow, okay? okay ah, no, no, no. No, we don't have class tomorrow. It's on Monday because today is Friday, right? Yes. Okay, and also I will send your homework in our Zalo. Okay, Huang? Okay. All right, so see you again on Monday. Bye-bye. Chukka. -bye.